It's beautiful. Amen. You turn your Bibles to Deuteronomy and chapter 3, beginning in verse 23. And I besought the Lord at that time, saying, O Lord God, thou hast begun to show thy servant thy greatness and thy mighty hand. For what God is there in heaven or in earth that can do according to thy words and according to thy might? I pray thee, let me go over and see the good land that is beyond Jordan, the goodly mountain in Lebanon. But the Lord was wroth with me for your sakes, and would not hear me. And the Lord said unto me, Let it suffice thee, speak no more unto me of this matter. matter. Get thee up into the top of Pisgah, and lift up thine eyes westward, and northward, and southward, and eastward, and behold it with thine eyes, for thou shalt not go over this Jordan. Let's remember this Moses that you're speaking about, his eye was not dimmed. He was able to see very well, but he could not go in. The message we have today is the message in the sermon is from Mr. B. It's the man who could not, but did. Amen. 